In this tutorial, we are going to explore some of SimLab Composer's features that would allow you to modify and improve your 3D model swiftly and without the need to revert to a CAD application. This is a room section of a house that was designed in SketchUp, and as you can see, it's consisting of two walls and a ceiling and several interior elements. Rendering this design as it is would not give a proper presentation of the space within the room so we need to create walls to contain the elements in the room. Go to Create Menu, and from Paths select Composite Path. The composite path we are about to create will serve as an outline for the walls we need to create. Click on the floor's outer corners to place the points where the wall's external side will be created and then continue on placing points to close the shape of the wall and determine its thickness. Once you're satisfied with the outline path you created, click on the green mark. The next step is creating a wall following the shape of the path you have just created. Go to the Create menu and under Features select Extrude. The Extrude tool in SimLab Composer allows you to create geometries based on the shape of a path. Select the path you created earlier, and set it as the profile for the wall extrude operation. Then determine the height of the wall you're planning to create and click OK. The wall has been created precisely as planned. Now you can go ahead and adjust the material attributes of the newly created wall. To add a window to the wall, go to the 3D Models Library and drag the window to the 3D area. Rotate the window and position it on the wall. You can use a parallel side view in combination with the X-ray view to accurately place the window with ease. To create an opening in the wall at the location of the window, go to the Create menu, and with the window selected, click on Bounding Box. A bounding box is a ghost box that is created based on the outer frame of the selected object. Using the scale points of the bounding box, you can extend the box in any direction. The bounding box we created will be used as a guide to crop a portion of the wall where the window sits. Go to the Geometry window and select the Difference Boolean operation. Select the wall as the first 3D object and click on the green mark to confirm it. And set the bounding box as the second 3D object. Click on the green mark to perform this operation and subtract the shape of the bounding box from the wall. As you can see, the window now fits perfectly in the wall with an opening that allows the sunlight to go into the room. Select the window's glass and convert it to light portals to intensify the effect of the sunlight going into the room. Click on Environment and adjust the angle and attributes of the sun. Then set the camera's angle for an interior shot. And from the Render menu, click on Real-Time Rendering. SimLab Composer offers great tools that when used conjointly can achieve great tasks with ease. The Extrude and Boolean operations are great tools that illustrate how SimLab Composer is a complete 3D visualization solution that can incredibly fulfill the designer's needs with ease and simplicity.